Hi, I'm Agent Smith, and this is The Lab. So, your computer is running slow. I can help with that. For this video, several agents and I put together a list of tech tips to speed up a PC that's running Windows 10. You might not need to do them all. What will work for you depends on what's bogging down your computer. Here's what you need. Your computer with Windows 10, model numbers for your computer or any hardware you added, trusted internet security software. And we're assuming that it's set up and working. If you have another operating system or you decide at any time that you'd rather have someone look at your computer for you, click on the link under this video to chat with an agent. They can tune up your computer remotely. First, let's make sure Windows 10 is up to date. New features can sometimes help performance. Click Start, then Settings, and in the menu, find Update and Security, then Windows Update. Click on Check for Updates, even if it says you're up to date. If it finds something new, get the update. Next, it's a good idea to make sure you have the latest hardware drivers. Those are pieces of software that allow Windows 10 to talk to the physical parts inside your computer, like the video card and outside devices like printers. You can download driver updates from the manufacturers. There's a link under this video to a list we made of popular tech companies' sites. Find the brand of your computer and click through to their site. You'll be able to find updates there. You may need the model numbers for your computer or any other things you've added, like a printer. Now, let's check for viruses or malware. Open your internet security software and run a scan. It's a good idea to do this monthly, and while you're at it, double check that your software is up to date so you're protected from new viruses. I didn't find any issues, but if you do, the software will tell you what to do. Next, check your internet speed. It might be the culprit. Especially if websites take a long time to load, streaming video buffers often, or online games are lagging. Follow the link below this video to check out our internet speed checker. Once you run the test, look at the upload and download speeds. Then, scroll down to this handy list. It'll explain what download speeds you might need to keep up with all the things on your network. Consider your computers, TVs you stream video on, and speakers you use to stream music. If you think you need more speed than you're getting, call your internet provider. Hot tip, while we're talking about internet speed, check how old your router is. If it's three or more years old, your router might be slowing down your Wi-Fi. Consider upgrading. Newer routers have the latest technology and can handle faster internet speeds better. Okay, back to the computer. Let's get rid of programs you don't use anymore. Here's how. Go to the Start menu, select Settings, then Apps. A list of all the apps and drivers you have installed will pop up. You can even sort them by when you installed them by clicking here. Remove programs you don't need by highlighting and then clicking Uninstall. Okay, time out. Only get rid of programs you know you don't need. If you're not sure or you don't recognize the name, it's best to leave it. If you have any questions, use the link below to chat with an agent. Got it? Cool. I just got a new printer, so I know I don't need the driver for my old one anymore. So I'm going to click Uninstall. Then follow any other steps. Repeat this for all the stuff you don't need anymore. Next, a full hard drive can sometimes bog down a computer, so make sure your storage is under control. Make sure Storage Sense is on. Head back to Start, then Settings, System, and Storage. You want this button to be set to On. Then Windows will schedule to automatically delete temporary system files. Stuff you don't need. Don't worry, your novel is safe. <laughs> if none of those things worked, it might be time to upgrade the hardware inside your computer. More RAM could help your computer access the data it needs faster. Or adding a bigger hard drive could help if yours is full. If that sounds complicated, don't worry, we've got you. Come talk to an agent, we can help you decide what you need and even install it for you. We hope this helped you speed up your computer. If none of these tips worked, click on that link I keep telling you about to chat with an agent or schedule some in-person help. There's a link to do that too. If you thought this video was helpful, give it a like and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips from Best Buy.
See ya.